Hi! If you have $600, you can save up to 2 seconds of looking back at your stool. Köhler. Köhler. I don't know how to read that. Cola. Köhler decoder is a toilet accessory that can check what you have done in there after you finish the job. The device sits over the rim of your toilet. With a camera, it looks down and it has a spectrometer which can check the wavelength of the light that can pass through the material it is looking at. It has a detachable battery pack which can wirelessly recharge and it has a wall-mounted remote controller which has a fingerprint sensor on it. After you are done, you can save your artwork with the finger print sensor and it saves it to your profile in their health app here is the cash the device is 600 dollars like i said it is quite pricey if you ask me but on top of that you have the subscription prices which starts from seven dollars per month for a single user and goes up to 13 dollars per month if you're a family of five i don't know if you can let your guests use it for a single demonstration and i don't know if it would be awkward to let them use your camera toilet jokes aside can this help you yeah it, it probably can give you some data well we shouldn't confuse this with actual lab tests but the premise is it can and track your urine and your stool in the means of frequency and consistency your hydration levels possible traces of blood and other anomalies also changes in color and clarity you know it can just track some stuff but i have some notes to share here you shouldn't wait for a 600 dollar device to check your stool go ahead and look back to it look what you've done i'm serious it can really help you detecting some sicknesses before they can get worse some news articles said that the camera doesn't quite work on dark toilets like in those black modern toilets i guess so one thing i can suggest is why this doesn't have a flashlight or an infrared camera or night vision or something another question that has been in my mind since i solved this product when should we use the fingerprint exactly because you know bathrooms get dirty and your hands get dirty doing stuff so here's two possible scenarios if you have done your job and your hands didn't get dirty then you should use it immediately the fingerprint sensor and after that flash the toilet and do other stuff but in the other scenario if your hands did get dirty you should first wash your hands i guess and then go back and use the fingerprint sensor and then flash the toilet and then wash your hands again that's a little bit tricky but i guess you can just figure it out i think overall it's cool that we are coming up with more ideas to track our health i guess the healthcare should be the first concern for everyone because like it's a, it's a common thing that we humans have but i still don't think it should be this much expensive like at least just don't do the subscription or just lower the price of the product itself at this price range you can purchase a waterproof phone too so i don't know i'm not suggesting anything but it's an option so maybe they should allow people into the app without the products and just by capturing the images themselves they want to send to the app with their phone camera that's an interesting idea that can happen just gave a billion dollar company an idea yep that's me you are probably wondering how i gave a billion dollar company an idea so what do you think about this toilet camera tell me your thoughts in the comments down below this is not an ad by the way i just want to talk about it it's an interesting idea if you like the video please subscribe and thank you for listening